so in order to reshape it uh, let me have this is array is d this this basically contains four elements so if i want to convert it to the four by four array what i can do here is that let me have here um, array underscore new and let me write here np dot reshape okay and here i have to write ar and inside of it i have to write here what uh two comma two okay and here we have this one so let me print it now and it will be now ar underscore new what will it will be so you can see that the size of it is now two by two okay or i can also use np dot shape okay so it will show me that this is basically two by two array similarly here what i can do here is that there is only a very important command that is the reshape okay so let me write here a r here a double r here and reshaping which vector here so that is b b and reshaping it to the two by two okay what will happen here so it will be this one three three one two three four okay so you can see that here the fundamental difference is that first row is converted to the first row of it while the second row of it is converted to the second uh, row of my newly constructed vector while here you can see that this one two the first uh, two elements were basically combined as the first column while the second or the last two elements here were constructed as the columns of my matrix here as well so uh, while adopting the numpy you have to keep these things in your mind okay so this is all about the reshaping uh, similarly what about the indexing so indexing remains the same if i want to access the first element here what i can write here i can write this zero so it will uh, show me the first row of my array which is here so what if i want to access the first element here okay this is basically what this is zero zero so if i want to access this element this is the first row so if i want to access it what i can write here i can write the zero zero and it will show me that this is this one similarly if i want to access this second element which is the five so what i can write here i can write here one okay so it will show me one similarly what if i want to access this last element this is in the second uh, row second column so i have to write here this one okay while here what i have to do this is array okay so this is zero and printing it here it will not work why it would not work because i have previously told you that zero is not the uh, index which is used inside the MATLAB so what you have to do you have to write here one so it will show you that it is one okay so the it is not showing you the first row here but the first element here similarly what if you want to see this fourth element you just have to write you just have to write r and four here so it will show you that this is the fourth one so uh, now that is the procedure inside of it what if you want to see this uh, first row here you have to write here array and here from one to two okay so writing it here you will see that the first uh, column of it will be denoted so that is about it and i have also uh, shown you the benefits of this colon operator uh, in my previous uh, in in the video which was related to the MATLAB. 